Hi there, and welcome. Imagine a world where you can ask a research question and get accurate, well-cited answers in seconds. As an educator and researcher, this is super important, not only for me as an instructor, but also for my students. With Answer This, that world is here. Whether you're writing a paper, preparing a lecture, studying for exams or creating educational content, Answer This puts the power of over 200 million academic sources. Answer This is AI research assistant designed to transform the way knowledge is discovered, synthesized, and shared. So imagine instead of spending hours searching through articles and databases, Answer This gives you clear, contextual answers with citations instantly. It bridges the gap between traditional research methods and modern AI methods, ensuring speed without sacrificing accuracy or academic integrity. Let me take you through some of the key features that I find amazing and you will too. I am on Answer This. Notice the center, that's my question. What is the impact of AI writing tools on EFL students? Academic writing. Now notice what's available here, automatic, full review or quick Q&A. Sources, notice I can decide if I wanna upload a PDF file, papers, use the internet or library, and then notice the mode can be light. And if I have a pro, I can use my pro account. And then notice I can explore the various tools best for researchers, literature review, search papers, citation map, chat with PDF, AI writer, extract data, diagram generator, which I really love. And if you're not sure of what any of these are, you click on the question mark and you get a demo. Not going to play it now, but you can do that on your own. Uh, Naturalizer, AI tool for creating comprehensive literature. And let's take a look at it. And we can use this for literature reviews with citation testing. And notice instant results, AI powered or custom trained. All this is available. So let's start with Naturalizer. And my question, and notice it is initializing. Going to come back to this later on. And that's another great thing with uh, Answer This is the fact that you can come back. You get email notifications when things are ready. And I love that. You don't have to stick around. You just ask and come back when it's ready. So notice this is what I have so far. Notice uh, APA style, the citations, inline citations, and the information is right here. Now notice uh, it's IEE, I want APA, seven, was this helpful, filters, rerun, and then notice you can share it privately, share it publicly, copy, uh, turn it into a PDF or docs. Isn't that absolutely amazing? We are going to go on here back to tools. And again, these are the featured ones that I can use an essay writer. And then I'll write my question again. Wait for that to happen. Notice initializing. But in the meantime, let's go into the left here and take a look at what's here. We've looked at, um, the query. We're going to look at the library. In the meantime, it's working on the AI writer. You can search for papers, citation map, diagram tools and teams, same things that you saw before in the format under features. So here it is. Notice this is just an essay writer. Isn't that great? You can go into a new chat straight from here, or let's go back to the left here and go into the library. This is a very brief overview of what's available. I suggest you do it at your own time. Take a look at it, see what you can do 
just giving you a little bit. These are the things that I had saved previously. So this is my library. You can create a library by going into Create Library. You can also share it. You can also upload papers, which is amazing. So notice here, this is what I was interested in, mindfulness. And it's all here, saved in my library. Let's go on to search papers. Notice here you can search their vast database to get all the relevant papers. So you can search for a paper. Uh, maybe I'll just look for that. Uh, AI writing. Okay, let's uh, see if there's a paper on that. And then search. Getting lots of papers. I, now notice you need to chat with whatever PDF is available. And then I'll be able to chat. Notice what happens here in the chat paper. I want to chat with there. There's the PDF on the left and I can chat on the right. Next, we're going to go into citation map. And there you can see it. All right, so here we go. There it is, set as original. And then notice there's the, you have to set as original to get the, uh, the map. Isn't that amazing? So that's the citation map. And then you can go into any of these, let's say paper information. Let me click on this one. And then I get information on this. And then I also get similar. I can refine citation or copy the citation here. So what else is here? Diagram and the tools that you've already seen. You can also work in Teams. I could spend a day on this because there's so much you can do here. I mean, it would have taken me years in the past, years to be able to conduct research like this. Let me know what you think after you try it out. Get an account. Thank you for watching. Try answer this. You'll be happy you did.